Correct and wonderful people, how una day welcome back to Texas TV. We don't carry another open gate, so we come on a domot about waiting the sub for palace. As information where they reach us now from inside the palace of Oni of Ife allegedly be say when Naomi Shilekola Ogunsi storm palace to meet Kabiesi face to face as we heard that Mommy Tedeneka would see it up in front of Kabiesi begging Kabiesi to set her free that she is already overwhelmed with the whole drama going on in their lives that things are not moving perfectly fine and they are all saying it that she when Naomi will not succumb to accepting many wives as his co-wife because he know she knows what she saw when she is in the palace so she not go allow the same mistake to repeat itself that it is better for Kabiesi to please and please set her free and go ahead and keep on marrying as many wives as possible as he can marry people were shocked to see Kabiesi and when Naomi right inside the palace. Yes, because nobody knows say when Naomi go enter palace after what happened yesterday. Yesterday was all tears upon tears for Mommy Tedenekau when Kabi Esi announced about Empress Madani that Kabi Esi Oba Adeyeye is about getting married to her. When Naomi was shocked because Kabi Esi just made another promise to her that she is not going to marry Princess Peju. So if you don't marry Peju, you are now going for Madani. That shows that whether I like him or not, that you must marry another wife into the palace. So when Naomi said, okay then, that she's tired, very, very tired of fighting against all this nonsensical behavior of Kabi Esi. That he better make everything end, make everybody go their separate ways. Than Kabi Esi hooking her down and at the same time knowing fairly well that she with Naomi no go accept all the Oloris with there for palace. It will be hard for her to do that. It better make she tell herself the truth. The same people that fought you tooth and nail every day by day when you were in the palace. Is the same people you are going to accept as your co-wives now. It is a, such a painful thing for Queen Naomi, so it better make she just withdraw out of palace. Since all promises were Kabiesi made to her, Kabiesi refuses to fulfill. Queen Naomi is no longer begging Kabiesi to make all promises come to pass, no. What we heard that Mommy Tedeneka is begging Kabiesi to do now, is to set her free. This one, when Naomi did not send her kinsmen, she did not send Deji of Akire, she did not send people that are very dear to her. She went straight to Kabiesi to discuss it with him, to talk about it with him. Yes, you don't say where people uh people okay naomi people don't don't they enter uh only of if a palace to go and beg kabiesi for peace to reign for kabiesi to make things the way it should be but it seems that kabiesi doesn't have a listening ear even if he has a listening ear he doesn't hit put his work into actions Yes, because sometimes actions speak louder than words. But Kabi Esi has failed to allow her action, uh, his action to speak louder than his words. Rather, he keep on compromising issues. My correct and wonderful people, I beg make a great sooner before we carry this hour of Wenge Apropo de Go. Good morning, afternoon, evening to you all according to your time. And the time where will I take that say this video. Yeah, welcome back to Texas TV and we are still on the gist about waiting the sub for palace. My country people back to the Tori as we did talk. You see when Naomi 
Once here one day, KBSC will come and knock at Queen Naomi door, and Queen Naomi will no longer open again. A time will come when Queen Naomi will turn and start showing KBSC Pepe where you need to see. Because Queen Naomi is a woman of endurance, she has endured a lot. She doesn't want to give KBSC a bad name. No matter all the things that is going on, she still maintains that KBSC is a good man. Okay, imagine the case of Queen May Edoche and Yule Edoche. You see the kind of bad name that uh, Queen May has given Yule Edoche. Yes. Yule Edoche right now has so many bad names just because he married another wife. But this one, Queen Naomi refused to give Kabiesi a bad name even though say Kabiesi has married six wives and about marrying more to make it them wives. Queen Naomi still insists that his her husband is a good man. So why would Kabiesi keep causing so much pain for Queen Naomi upon say Queen Naomi is making people to understand that Kabiesi just made a mistake, that Kabiesi is a good man. Remember the message that we made a dossier sent to Queen Naomi Shide Kola Ogunsi? To better pick her broken pieces and move on, forget about Kabiesi. Forget about everybody waiting for that palace. Move on with your lives. Yes, get to work. Turn on your pain into energy and get to work with it and see Kabiesi looking for you. But we don't know whether Naomi has refused to give Kabiesi a bad name. Maybe truly Kabiesi is a good man. Maybe truly Kabiesi is not a good man, but all oh, is in Queen Naomi's hand. You see how Queen May Edoche is making waves in so many companies, in the in movie industry, in a lot of companies, giving you Edoche a better bad name. That is to tell you the power of woman. Yes, when I see women, they get power. And Queen Naomi is one of that women that get that power. But she refused to make that uh, use of her own power. She is still respecting Kabiesi. But Kabiesi doesn't know say Queen Naomi is still respecting him up till today. Rather, Kabiesi keeps on misbehaving. And that is why Queen Naomi went to the palace straight. Look Kabiesi in the eyes face to face and ask Kabiesi to set her free. Set me free traditionally and move on with your life. If you want to marry 100 wives, you are free to do that. Any a, a number of wives you want to marry, you are free. Just set me free and go your way. Let me go my way. But we heard that Kabiesi has refused to do such. My correct and wonderful people. Now, did so we? Maybe we carry on with this. I beg, make could I try to come out for this matter. Grab your comments. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel. Stay tuned, stay connected for more updates. We'll be dropping from time to time about waiting the sub for Palace. And for my returning subscribers, I can never cease to appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you guys so very much.